All right, so let's um, do this again. I'd like you to do another practice problem. So here I'm going to say A is equal to um, CD or BCD or B not C D. So stop the video here and um, first make yourself a little truth table inputs and outputs. It's a three input. We have B, C, and D. And um, then go ahead and try to fill in the truth table for yourself. So now what I'd like to do is I'm going to um, work through this example. I hope you've paused it now and work the example for yourself. So I'm going to do B, C, D. Those were my inputs. A is my output. Zero, 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 one, zero, one. 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 0, 0, 1, 0, 1, 1, 1, 0, 1, 1, 1. Whew. All right. So now let's go through and look at our terms. I have CD. So when I just have CD, I don't care what B is. So CD. Here it is. I have a C for 1, a D. I'll put a 1 there in my truth table. Now I'll look through and find anywhere else that's true. It's true on the very last line, C and D. So I'll put a 1 in. All right, now I'm looking for B, C, D. Well, I already got B, C, D. Here it is, one, B, C, D, but it's already marked. And then I need B, not C, D. So let's see, B is a 1, doesn't start till here. I'm looking for not C, that's a 0. D, nope, that one. All right, so now I've put my ones in. I need to go back and put my zeros in my truth table. And did you get the right answer? I hope that worked out for you.